Ashley, just standing outside for five minutes is tough. Now imagine waiting in line for two hours in the freezing temperatures and snow. That's what a lot of folks did today. Many who are sick, all of them just trying to confirm whether or not they are with the test without a lot of options. Looks like it's over a two hour wait to get a to get the test outside the Oregon Convention Center. I mean, everybody's standing around cold. The lines for a COVID test show just how much those here want or need one. Probably moved like 30 feet in the last half hour to 45 minutes. This site is a partnership between testing company Curative and the Oregon Health Authority. While you can make appointments online, you'll still have to wait in line. I may miss a few meetings. Robert Tresente learned about that detail on his work break. So we were kind of under the assumption that, you know, we'd be able to come up and get it done pretty quickly. It's just one point of frustration for those seeking a COVID test in this winter weather. At the Portland Expo Center, OHSU's drive through testing site is now closed all week. Hospital officials are concerned over cold, slippery conditions for volunteers, drivers and patients. We took it very seriously before we closed, knowing that that was an important resource to the community, but it just it wasn't safe for us this week. Many drugstores are out of home COVID tests during a time when demand is high after the holiday. And not everyone is willing to wait outside in the cold. That opens the door to another concern. That some people may go out and just spread it anyway because they don't want to stand in this line. Hospital officials offer a more responsible alternative if you can't get tested. Stay home in quarantine. Assume that you are positive and, you know, keep yourself safe and others safe. Um, so that is what we would most strongly encourage. The Oregon Health Authority has posted a long list of testing sites, including closures. We've posted that information on our website, kgw.com. Ashley, back to you. Kathy